welcome to another vlog. It is 8.30 in the morning. I just got my workout in and today we are going to go to the Americana. They have a kids club. It's an outside mall and I'm going to meet up with a couple of friends and we're going to go and have fun and see what it's all about. <gasps> As you can tell, I've been getting out a lot more lately and yesterday I went to the park completely by myself. I didn't meet up with a friend or anything. I just had to go to the post office and I was like, why not just like stop by the park? And so we did and we had a nice time. We almost got attacked by a squirrel, but we were safe. We kept it safe. But yeah, welcome to another vlog. just easier than others when it comes to taking a shower getting ready sometimes he's sleeping sometimes he's up sometimes he stays on his swing for the entirety of my shower and my skincare routine and all that stuff but sometimes he doesn't and so I have to find solutions so I can do what I need to do right Papa <laughs> So I saw an interesting post this morning. I feel like I've seen this before from other people as well. This was an influencer and she was saying that, like people saying that your life is over once you have kids, but like, look at me, I travel with my six month old and I'm sitting in a cafe and my life is not over, blah, 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 which is awesome. And a lot of people in the comments were like, thank you for sharing this perspective. Cause all I hear about motherhood is the negative aspect and I'm scared to have kids or, you know, people saying oh this is my experience and like I said in one of my previous videos like when I gave my disclaimer everyone's experience is different and there's a lot of factors that kind of affect what kind of motherhood journey or postpartum journey you go through I feel like that was my perspective my life is not gonna be over when I have a kid I'm gonna be one of those moms who's up and going and all that stuff and I still believe that I don't think my life is over by any means but I do think that my life is in a pause right now because you know I experienced postpartum anxiety and I'm exclusively breastfeeding and so breastfeeding in public is not something that I'm like 100% comfortable with I, I am getting comfortable with it you know so like I said I don't I don't think my life is over I think it's in a pause right now but I'm trying to get back into the swing of things and I'm not putting any pressure on myself because I know like everyone's journey is different and I have seen this influencer's journey and I and I see her I'm like oh my gosh she's amazing all these things that she's doing she gets out of the house every day but I thought that that was going to be my journey and unfortunately or not unfortunately it's just that it's different it's different for everybody so I feel like sometimes when we look at influencers content creators and we see like what they're going through that we we judge ourselves based on that but everyone's journey is different and even my journey. I hope that no one looks at my content and feels and feels bad about the current state that they're in. I'm on the upswing and I know that this journey has its peaks and valleys. There's gonna be days where I feel super motivated, super productive, and some days I'm gonna feel like I can't do anything depending on the stage because I know there's gonna be a lot more stage that he's gonna go through and that's okay. I love you. Let's see. Work today. Maybe. Yeah. Baby is down for a nap. I'm gonna finish getting ready. I've been using this hair oil. My friend recommended it to me for my postpartum hair loss. She said it helped her, so I'm willing to give it a try. So I'm going to make breakfast and we're gonna eat breakfast before we get dressed in case he gets dirty, I get dirty. We don't have to do an outfit change. I'm gonna eat breakfast today. Lately, I've been forgetting to take my vitamins. I'm still taking prenatals because I'm breastfeeding. Prenatal, postnatal, I feel like it's the same. And then I always take probiotics in the morning. But lately, I've just been forgetting because I haven't, I don't do it first thing in the morning then I usually forget, which is crazy because I don't know if it's mom brain, but all right. Today on the menu, we have some oatmeal with bananas mashed in there for the baby. I'm going to sit right here with you. Let's do it. I think I have... 
Let's go, papi. We made it, we parked. I have to look for the elevator and I have to remember where I parked. Elevator's not working. I guess I'm gonna have to go the long way because. Should we try this? Okay. Are you okay, Papa? So we just made it just in time. I found a little patch of shade. was a little crazy i would never do that again like i was going down the escalator by myself i've done it with my husband before but by myself i was like i'm strong enough but then he got scared because it was like really steep so yeah not doing that again it sucks that the elevator was broken and it wasn't the only elevator that was broken because my friend parked in a different part of the parking lot and she had to go through this whole loop find an elevator inside the mall and remember we were going to the out door mall it's just like two malls kind of like together and one is outdoors and one is inside so to get back to our car i did the whole loop through the, the indoor mall to get to the parking lot baby was so cranky and tired he and so he was impatient he ended up falling asleep and i transferred him into his car seat without him waking up and we drove all the way home without him waking up so he woke up when we arrived which was awesome so only slept like 30 minutes i know he's still tired i did give him milk before we left but honestly i was so stressful too so what i realized the more and more that i go out i realize how some things are inconvenient when you have a stroller or even if someone is on a wheelchair or something i just feel like people blocking driveways people blocking sidewalks whatever elevators that don't work anyway thank you so much for coming along on this vlog with us i'll see you in another video bye